Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're doing really well. I'm back with another video and today it's another one of my jeans guys. We're going back to Levi's today. I'm not going to try on all 28 of the styles that we tried on last time. I'll pop a link to that video up there if you've not seen it already. But I found 11 brand new styles, so we'll be trying all of those on today. That's another rambling from me. Let's get straight into the try on. First up, we have the wedgie icon fit jean. These are designed to make your bottom look its best, hence the name. And they also have a straight tapered leg that comes in one leg length which I measured to have a 27 inch inseam. I'm wearing them here in a 25 waist and based on that size, these have a 10 and a half inch front rise, so they're a high rise. The color I'm wearing here is composed of 100% cotton, so they're a non-stretch denim and they also have a button fly. Next up, we have the Jane Doe jean, which are from Levi's Made and Crafted line. These are a crop tapered leg and they come in one leg length, which I measured to have a 25 and a half inch inseam. I'm wearing them here in a 25 waist and based on that size, these have a 10 and a half inch front rise, so they're a high rise. I'm wearing them here in a 25 waist and based on that size, these have a 10 and a half inch front rise, so they're a high rise. The colour I'm wearing here is composed of 100% cotton, so they're a non-stretch denim, and they also have a button fly. Next up, we have the mom jean. These have a regular fit through the hip and thigh, going down into a tapered leg. These come in one leg length, which I measured to have a 27 inch inseam. I'm wearing them here in a 24 waist, and based on that size, these have an 11 inch front rise, so they're a high rise. The colour I'm wearing here is composed of 100% cotton, so they're a non-stretch denim, and they also have a zipper fly. Next up, we have the 501 crop jean. These are the iconic 501 jean reimagined in a crop's length. So they're a straight fit, which is available in either a 26 or a 28 leg, depending on the colour. I'm wearing them here in a 25 waist with a 26 leg. And based on that size, these have a 10 and a half inch front rise, so they're a high rise. The colour I'm wearing here is composed of 100% cotton, so they're a non-stretch denim, and they also have a button fly. Next up we have the Line 8 Crop Flare Jean. These are a slim jean that flares at the ankle and they come in one leg length, which I measured to have a 25 and a half inch inseam. I'm wearing them here in a 25 waist and based on that size, these have a 10 and a half inch front rise, so they're a high rise. The colour I'm wearing here is composed of 98% cotton and 2% elastane, so they're a stretch denim, and they also have a button fly. Next up, we have the ribcage straight ankle fit jean. These are a straight leg jean that come in either a 27 or a 29 leg. I'm wearing them here in a 25 waist with a 27 leg. And based on that size, these have an 11 and a half inch front rise, so they're a super high rise. The colour I'm wearing here is composed of 99% cotton and 1% elastane, so they're a low stretch denim, and they also have a button fly. Next up, we have the 1950s 701 pin tuck crop jean, which are from Levi's vintage clothing line. These are Levi's 1950s 701 style, customised with a pin tuck to create a slim fit and a cropped length that I measured to have a 25 inch inseam. I'm wearing them here in a 25 waist and based on that size, these have a 12 inch front rise, so they're a super high rise. The colour I'm wearing here is composed of 100% cotton, so they're a non-stretch denim and they also have a zipper fly. Next up, we have the passenger pants, which are from Levi's Made and Crafted line. These are a relaxed wide leg that only come in a 32 leg on the UK website. I'm wearing them here in a 25 waist, 
and based on that size, these had a 13 inch front rise, so they're a super high rise. The colour I'm wearing here is composed of 100% cotton, so they're a non-stretch denim, and they also have a zipper fly. Next up we have the baggy crop jean. These are a relaxed fit with a cropped leg length, which I measured to have a 24 inch inseam. I'm wearing them here in a 25 waist, and based on that size, these have a 10 and a half inch front rise, so they're a high rise. The colour I'm wearing here is composed of 100% cotton, so they're a non-stretch denim, and they also have a zipper fly. Next up, we have the high water wide leg jean. These are a wide leg jean and they come in one cropped leg length, which I measured to have a 24 inch inseam. I'm wearing them here in a 25 waist, and based on that size, these have an 11 and a half inch front rise, so they're a super high rise. The colour I'm wearing here is composed of 100% cotton, so they're a non-stretch denim, and they also have a button fly. And lastly, we have the Aunt Mum jean from Levi's Line 8 line. These have a straight fit with a tapered leg that comes in one cropped leg length, which I measured to have a 25 inch inseam. I'm wearing them here in a 25 waist, and based on that size, these have a 10 inch front rise, so I'd say they're a high rise, but at the lower end. The colour I'm wearing here is composed of 98% cotton and 2% elastane, so they're a stretch denim and they also have a zipper fly. So that was it for the try-ons, which ones were your faves this time? For me, I've definitely got a few new faves. You guys know I love my wedgie straights, so of course the wedgie icons were right up my street, so I really like those ones. I'm also loving the fact that there's some new super high-waisted styles in there. So there's the rib cage ones, I really like those. They're super high waist, which is great. And non-stretch denim, which is also my fave. I also really like the mom jean. I love a good mom jean anyway. And to have a Levi's one, like specifically, is really nice. So I like that one. I also really like the 501 crop. I think that one would look really great with a heeled ankle boot. Um, so yeah, really like that one as well. And I also really like the high water wide for a wider leg style. I think the colour of the ones I tried on in the video were like the perfect jeans colour. So love those ones as well. So yeah, definitely got some new faves. But how about you? Let me know in the comments down below. Oh, before I forget, Levi's also have, so you know like their typical styles, their 501, you know, the standard core ones that we tried on last time. They actually brought out um, new materials. So these ones I'm wearing today, I treated myself to. These ones are made from selvage denim, so it's like a thicker, just nicer quality denim, basically. So yeah, those were my faves, but how about you? Which ones were your favorites? That was it for today's video. I really hope you found it helpful. If you did, make sure to give this video a thumbs up to let me know that you did, and I'll know to make more of them. I've got some really fun videos lined up, which I can't wait to get cracking on, so keep your eyes peeled for those. In the meantime, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, remember to subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye.